DPP primary candidate Lai Qingde may have hit pause on his real-life campaign, but his showdown with President Tsai Ing-wen continues on Facebook. Before President Tsai left for her eight-day state visit, Lai said he would take a break from the campaign trail to minimize her distractions. Be that as it may, both presidential hopefuls have taken to social media, making the case for why they're the best person for the job. The president shouldn't just be a star athlete. The president should also be a good captain. After registering her candidacy in the party primary, President Tsai said a president should have three traits. Later, she posted the three traits on Facebook. Not long after, her challenger took to Facebook as well to once again outline his pragmatic approach to Taiwan independence. Being pragmatic as you work for Taiwan independence, what does that mean? First, it means you believe that Taiwan is a sovereign, independent country that therefore does not need to declare its independence. Second, it means you believe Taiwan's future can only be decided by its 23 million people. Third, it means you believe that Taiwan's priorities should be developing its economy and making the country strong. Lai has said before that his pragmatic views are identical to those the DPP outlined in the 1999 resolution on Taiwan's future. His latest Facebook post has been seen as a low-key broadside against Tsai. When people bring up their strengths, we seize the opportunity to try to bring them down. I don't feel that there's a deeper meaning to the words. Everyone will bring up their best points. The DPP lawmaker urged political watchers not to read too much into things. Meanwhile, Premier Su Zhenchang, who is on the newly formed negotiation committee, said he wished to see the primary successfully run its course. The DPP is a party with a process in place. At present, the process is in the negotiation stage, so we'll handle that properly. A smooth process is what most of our supporters want. So long as we have a smooth process and a complete process, we will have the most satisfactory result. President Tsai gets back from her state visit next week and will start talks with a primary rival. With party unity at stake, the five members of the negotiation committee have the work cut out for them.